How many positive integers less than or equal to 2020 have at least two adjacent digits that are identical? Is it? Are there 462, 472, 552, 553, or 570? If you have any questions about the question, feel free to ask. Luke? B is in Bernoulli, 472. Incorrect. But Luke, you can still figure in case Austin doesn't get it. Right. Austin, you have 60 seconds. Right about 10 seconds, Austin. Okay. All right, Austin? A. A? 462? That is correct. Yeah. Right, nice going, Austin. A little bit of pressure there, Austin. Yeah. Uh, so you weren't really sure? Is that why you waited yeah, that, till the... Yeah. <laughs> and so were um, you, did you get a number that was close to 462? Or? About, yeah. I mean, the basic approach is just you can do, like, casework on whether the repeated one is, like, if it's not a one, then it's easy. You can just figure out. It's like the last two digits, like, the middle two digits are the same, not one. The last two, and then you subtract about one, and the last three are all the same. And then you can do casework on where, like, the two ones are. But mm -hmm. it's just... Adding and subtracting up the case of the overlap is a bit tricky. Yeah, there's a, there's a lot of counting to be done. Yeah. I don't think there's, there's no slick way to do it in one step, for example. Uh, so congratulations on getting that right, Austin. Uh, and uh, since we're uh, at the halfway point here, Austin, I was going to ask you, you, you said you're named after two literary people. That is true. My, uh, my name is Austin Twain is my middle name, so Jane Austen and Mark Twain. Because, yeah, when your parents are English teachers, that's what you stuck with. Uh, and your yeah. birthday? And yeah, my birthday is on April 23rd, which is the same birthday as William Shakespeare. So it's a lot of literary talent, and I think it, it showed through in the poem, hopefully. Um, <laughs> good, we'll good one, Austin. And, and then as long as we're asking questions, Luke, uh, did you do anything this summer math-wise uh, in another country? The International Math Olympiad yeah, in and Bath, it, so England, where Team USA won, tied for first, and we all got gold medals also. That yes, was okay, that's nice going. That's right. Uh, I painted one of the rooms in my house. I thought that was pretty good. Uh, but uh, nice going, Luke, to the, you and Thanks. the team. Uh, I'll get, that's very good.